All right, here we go again with another Dark Tower up on eBay. If you look at the, the eBay page, I've also got photos of this below, but this will give you a better look, and we can definitely give you a better look at the box. And um, we'll go through the contents um, and the tower test at the end, just so you know exactly what you're getting. I know I could just take the same photos over and over again, but for each item up on eBay, I want you guys to see exactly what you're getting. So let's take a look at this one, starting with the box. Another one uh, with rough corners, split, another split, bit of a warp to it as well. Um, if you've looked at the other ones so far, like I said, these are coming out of a warehouse where they just sat around and I think got pushed around a lot. So the better ones still have their cellophane and then ones like this have lost their cellophane and in this case, this one, somewhere along the lines, has actually lost its cardboard inserts. Um, but, you know, contents are still mint, like you'll see in a minute. Now, when it comes time to shipping this, I will do my best to create um, a similar um, cardboard packing insert like the other Dark Towers have, just to protect the tower and um, the rest of the contents. So. I pack well, so no need to worry there. It'll get there in, in good shape. So let's just fly through it really quick. Instruction book, warranty card, Pegasus cards, and the pegboard. Unpunched, not used. The game boards, again. See, I'm only opening these a bit because they've got that great cracking sound that a board game gets when you when you open it. So I'm going to let you guys do that. I'm going to keep these just the way they are. But, you know, never been opened. They look dead mint. For the innards. There we go. All four player pieces sealed in the bag. And then you've got your large bag with every other accessory in it. The stickers, the pegs, um, the buildings, the dragon, the tower base, all here sealed. Um, the spare bulb in the instruction sheet. There's the tower. Um, bottom of this box, you can see it's got, I don't know if you can see that, it's got a bit of a, a ding in that as well. But, you know, a little bit of tape and you're good. So there you have it. We'll go um, ahead and test this tower now. Okay, we'll do a quick run through with the tower. If you can see that uh, game board, it's nice and, or sorry, game board keypad. It's nice and nice and clean. No wear and fingerprints. Never been used except for me um, messing around with here, of course. So let's do the tower test. If you can see that, there we go. Okay, looks good. Like I said before, I don't know how to play this, so I'm just going to set up a, a two-player game like I did before in the other one, and um, here we go. Let's get her spinning. Anyways, hopefully that's enough that you guys uh, can see that it's working well, it's spinning well. 
and I'm assuming working the way it should be. Like I said, I don't know how to play it, but uh, away she goes. It looks good. So, uh, yeah, any questions, let me know. Thanks.